Should I take on investors before I launch my idea? Will VCs invest? I think the answer to that is, is broadly no. Um, I think it's, you know, starting with friends and family money is scary because they're your friends and family, but they invest in you. They'll see the light in your eyes in most cases for the first time because you've been working jobs that are sort of just jobs. And now you're doing the thing you love. You love coffee and you're starting a cold brew brand. Hooray, hooray. Um, and they'll be like, cool, I've never seen Joey like this before. I know I'll put in five grand, 10 grand. You can do it through uh, financial instruments that are very lightweight, like safes, they're called. Um, they move very quickly. They're a page or two of legal documents. A priced round, which is a more mature, you know, so serious financial vehicle, you know, is a 20 page document and might cost you 15 grand with lawyers. It's a much bigger deal. So moving fast, closing around quickly, getting 20, 30, 50 K from friends and family, um, 10, 20, 30 K, whatever, um, lets you sort of iterate and find that product market fit. Now, when you have friends and family watching you so closely, it's very easy to feel that pressure and to let that make the voices in your head that you need to go and get bigger and grow and be loud. And you want to have exciting things. I got into Whole Foods. A thousand people came to my website this month. We did 4,000 in sales this month. All of those things feel good, but those are all top of funnel things. Once again, we're not focusing on is the product fundamentally good? No friend or family is going to want to hear that you spent 16 hours on your email nurture sequencing or on your site optimization or on the formula for the cold brew. That's less sexy than saying I got into Whole Foods or 10,000 people went to my website this month. When it comes to VCs, you know, very early on, it's so speculative that their terms are very predatory. They'll take big stakes of your company. Um, I think it's best to wait until you have proof of concept and it's something they can really chew on and the quantum of risk is lower. It's not just some idea. You actually have traction and some proof of concept before you go and seek a larger check from, a, from an institution like a venture capitalist. 